All right, welcome back, witches, wizards, and goblins. We are here about to enter the Keeper's Caverns and defend Hogwarts from Ranrock's final attack on the last repository. Let's get right into it without delay. I should hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. Oh, <laughs> 
Professor, that wall, that's the way forward. Very perceptive. My young friend. It worked. Let's go. Lumos! Ranrock must be getting closer to finding the repository. I fear you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can do but keep searching. Closer, Professor. That way. Here comes the cavalry. The yeah. <laughs> defensive charts. Sharp with us!
gonna say, how are we ever gonna get through? We have to keep fighting trolls. <laughs> I was thinking maybe Nigelius Black would show up and actually do something to help us, but so far everyone's here except for him. We'll see. We'll see by the end of the story. Is he a coward or is he actually courageous? <laughs> oh, this trick in the book. Thanks, Professor. Oh, we gotta take two of these guys down. We can do it. I believe in us. Or we use the one. Use the one to stand them down. before Ranrock. I'm not so sure we did. I can't believe this is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. Based on the size Think of the of devices, the it's pain not as, uh, that created not as big as I thought. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed you. You are now the Keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? Uh, <laughs> if I was doing like a more selfish, egotistical, I would open it. But obviously we want to contain it. Or... After playing a good character this entire time, am I going to shock you all by becoming a evil person at the very end? No. <laughs> I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking... What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I plan to keep it secret for now. But in time, when I am ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. God. The arrogance of wizard kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container, all of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <coughs> Seems you were two of a kind. She didn't know when to 
give up either.
think I do. I think I'm kicking some goblin ass. That's right. You better run. That's right. Stop running and fight me. It doesn't let me stop the combo. The block is there. You go. Yeah, you can time it just right. Bad. This would be a good time to be able to throw these because they can actually shoot these ones. I put one out, but it's not very useful. Get him? Come on, Ranrock. Come on, you filthy frickin' goblin. 
is at the stand, I will race to the moment to make him fifty the moment. Because he is the king. <laughs> oh, man. Man, the try the try wander. This is it. Sacrifice our life to do something great. Unless Fig's gonna show up out of nowhere and get it out of here. Yeah, good, he's alive. Get us out of here, Professor. I guess that's it. It's our ancient power. It's up to us. Man, that was heavy. <clears throat> professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you. Suddenly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation... charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and... Safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. Um, <clears throat> <laughs> Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig. Well, 
I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, justly, and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig! I can't believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good man. Glad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. Sebastian, there's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did, but it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait, what, what are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This, this can't be. It was the loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her, and she's never been the same. So cruel. Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. All this time, I thought goblins were the enemy. But it was never that simple. I have a lot to think about. Let's speak again soon. Whew, man, that was heavy, and now we're into springtime. End of school year, I guess. Ooh. So we got to do our owls still and some other things and finish some other quests. Man, that is, that's like a finale feel. And I don't think the game's close to being over yet. I think we still have a lot to do. You've completed the story of Hogwarts Legacy and reached the end of your school year. With your owl exams fast approaching, now is a good time to review your field guide progress, explore the world, finish any remaining relationship storylines and quests, and complete your field guide as you see fit. There you go, guys. Um, so it looks like uh, it's up to us now to kind of play around and, and do what we want. I promised you guys that I was going to, you know, focus on the main story and get through those quests. Little did I know there was only a couple left. Um, wow, look at that. Preparing for owls, we're just finishing up everything else. So. Um, all right, guys, thank you so much for watching. An emotional goodbye to Professor Fig. Um, but you know what? We still got some stuff here with Sebastian. We still have stuff with Natty, and we want to finish up the poachers. I think I'm going to do the poachers mission next, and then we're going to finish kind of uh, the rest of these and, and whatever other little side quests we can find um, before we uh, do our owls. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, this will basically conclude the main story of the game, and if you'd like to continue to watch episodes, please do. I will be posting more episodes of more Hogwarts Legacy gameplay, um, but I'm also going to start posting my videos for um, my Horizon Forbidden West leading up to the Burning Shores DLC coming out in just a couple months. So thank you guys so much for watching and following along through all the episodes of this game. I love every second I get to play this game because there's always something new and fresh 
and something exciting to enjoy. Um, it's been an absolute pleasure, and I appreciate every single one of you who's watched my videos, liked, subscribed to my channel. It means the world to me. So thank you guys very much, and we'll see you on the next gameplay episode here on Button Mash Kingdom.